Here's what we're watching as the trading day gets going in London. Investors have connected the dots and are buying equities. The Federal Reserve's measured approach towards tightening policy this year has pressured the dollar and bolstered gold. Expectations for a US rate tightening in June have dropped below 50%, not helping the case for dollar bulls. Feeling better, emerging market currencies thanks to the weaker dollar and a better tone for copper and oil. After Wall Street's overnight rally, Asia and European shares are firmer. Sentiment Europe also helped by the Dutch election, keeping a firm lid on populism. Dutch and French bonds are performing better against German bunds. Central banks are also continuing to overshadow the markets. Japan kept policy steady while China raised borrowing costs. The Swiss central bank has sat on its hands and not surprisingly still says the franc is too strong. Later, we get to hear from the Bank of England and given the uncertainty over Brexit, expect a dovish message. That likely means little relief for the pound, with the currency bumping along near the bottom of its post-Brexit trading range.